Three horses crammed into a slaughter pen. By law, horses should not be slaughtered in sight of one another. But at the Red Lion Abattoir near Nantwich, we found numerous occurrences of this. And a host of illegal welfare breaches that add pain and distress to the animals. We came here after concerns were raised by an animal welfare group, Hillside Animal Sanctuary. Their investigators fitted cameras that would capture appalling images at what is a licensed abattoir in Cheshire, exporting horse meat to continental Europe. We then showed the footage to two veterinary experts, including the government's former chief vet, Keith Meldrum. Three animals are, have been stunned in the same pen at the same time, which is totally illegal, contrary to the welfare at slaughter regulations. That is appalling. That animal appears to be coming round from the stun. Why is it waiting so long? Oh no, that is a clear indication that it may well be conscious again. It's coming round from the stun. And that is totally and completely unacceptable. If the horse in front of it is being put down, you can only imagine the distress that that animal is going through. So there are, in my, de in my view, without doubt welfare implications. But also, it's plain illegal. <laughs> Other concerns included suffering horses that were not put down immediately. This one appears to have colic, another a painful leg condition. The animals here have come from a variety of backgrounds, some former pets, some show jumping or race horses at the end of their careers. We'd like to think that these horses end up in green pastures, but this is the reality for many race horses. It may be the sport of kings. They're not treated like royalty here. The British Horse Racing Authority confirmed around 500 racehorses are slaughtered for meat every year. During the investigation, Hillside rescued this one, called Underwriter, at auction, discovering it had a distinguished career. It's not just ill and old horses being killed. There are very many fit and healthy horses, horses with foals, pregnant mares, um, and of course thoroughbreds that, um, that are being treated quite badly. It really blows away the myth of humane slaughter um, and there's a, there's a misery in that place which is palpable. We gave these images to the Food Standards Agency. As soon as we got the footage and reviewed it, we've taken immediate action to revoke the slaughterman's licences. Uh, that means they cannot work to slaughter animals again. We'll also investigate further, gathering further evidence to look at whether we can prosecute. The Red Lion Abattoir told us they view animal welfare and public health with paramount importance. They have three full-time food standards officers throughout production. The incidents were not the norm, but that of an isolated nature, and they've taken disciplinary action against the individual featured. They agree horses should individually enter the stunning area, but say in some circumstances separating them causes more stress. They also insist their meat was not part of the recent supermarket burger scandal. Thoroughbreds. The number of UK horses ending up in slaughterhouses has doubled in five years to over 8,000 in 2012. So high welfare for these animals is more important than ever. Jason Farrell, Sky News.